In 2021, numerous civilians, including children, have been massacred in the district of Maikanatal by Ethiopian and Eritrean forces. Taganet and Letaran's children, together with Fishai's three siblings and other three of his relatives, were taken from their respective houses by Eritrean troops. Then, they were shot and killed. <laughs> My son and I were running away into the wilderness. They found my son and killed him along with three other men on the 8th of February 2021. His body was left unburied. It was abandoned there for more than three days. Now it is in the mass grave as we haven't been able to lay it to rest on its own burial place. The soldiers said we want to save our bullets and bombed five people of whom were priests a bride and a bridegroom as well as elders. The soldiers didn't allow us to bury the dead on time. Some of the bodies were eaten by dogs and scavengers. Three of my siblings were killed by the Eritrean forces. They were only students. They had nothing to do with any militarized group. Their killing was unspeakably atrocious and satanic. Debra Talaymanad, administrator of the district of Maikanatal, says that the Ethiopian forces and their allies from Eritrea have committed numerous allegations on civilian residents of the district. They massacred countless civilians regardless of their age, sex, religion, and their identity. They burned down crops and houses of civilians. Many animals of the vicinities of our district were looted. Infrastructures were also destroyed. They mixed grains with soil into flowers so that they wouldn't be eaten.